Hello, wind and sun are uh, the most widespread energy resources that we can use them for electricity production. As an electrical engineer, I try to explode those resources in buildings. In that way, it is possible to sell and buy electricity to the power system. The benefits are cheaper bills, higher efficiency, and less air pollution, which is the main concerning issues nowadays. However, sun and wind are not always available. So we need energy storage like batteries to save their energy, especially during the day. And then we can use the saved energy in batteries whenever we need them, especially during the evenings. Power electronic interfaces are used for that purpose, to control the uh, sources like uh, panel, solar panels and batteries and some energy consumers. The other issue is that solar panels and batteries, they are DC in nature. We have some DC energy consumer as well, like uh, LEDs, screens, laptops, phone cells, and etc. So to increase the efficiency, we implement both AC and DC in our system. We use power electronic interface to convert that AC to DC. However, during that conversion, we find some unwanted power are produced, that they burn our capacitor in this site. As a result, capacitors are the main fragile elements in our system. So, are they necessary to be used? Yes, capacitors in DC site stabilize our DC site. They act as an energy buffer. I'm Mahdi Najafzadeh from Tallinn University of Technology. During my PhD, I focus on enhancement and minimization of DC lean capacitor by control of the battery as an energy buffer.